There is one road that connects Manali and Leh, one breathtaking yet deeply challenging path that takes cyclists on an exquisite journey of self-exploration. This road is tough enough for those who can see it. For those who can't, that's what we're about to find out. The visually impaired community never fails to prove that a lack of sight does not mean a lack of strength. These riders took to one of the world's most testing routes on tandem bicycles, working together to come out victorious on the other side. This is Clued. He's traveled more than 100,000 kilometers on tandem bikes. This is Goulet, a passionate marathon runner who's pushing her limits by traveling from Manali to Ley by tandem for the first time. It was okay, but I was very cold like everyone, so I didn't want to stay so much there and just say, okay, now we are, we are on top, so let's go, let's go down. <laughs> top is a Swiss-based initiative that takes visually impaired riders on journeys all around the world, supported by devoted volunteers. If you're wondering how visually impaired riders can demystify such a challenging route, the secret is simple. The tandem captain navigates the journey, guiding the headstrong team from start to finish. While this may provide a visual representation of the road ahead, it doesn't solve the rocky surfaces or dangerous terrain. Only the boldest and bravest members of the community would dare face a challenge like this head on where one wrong move could risk your livelihood. The risks may be high, but for our tenacious riders, the value of victory is higher. The physical challenges aren't the only hurdles in the way, from bike breakdowns to altitude sickness, mental fears, and more. There's a lot to be afraid of, but there's much more to gain on the other side. While fear is temporary, regret is forever, and these riders would live the ride all over again in a heartbeat. They may not be able to see physically, but they can see the value of diving into the unknown, no matter the risk. If they can do it, what's your excuse?